Afternoon guys, Locks and Low here. Hey, I came up with a good idea. I thought it'd be pretty educational. So I'm gonna help you new guys and beginners with some of the gun terminologies you're gonna encounter in the gun world or when you're buying. This one is on the triggers that you're most likely to encounter. So first is DO, I mean DAO, double action only. That is with a heavy trigger pull, usually 10 to 12 pounds or so. And you get that heavy trigger pull every time where the trigger pulls back the hammer and then continually continuing to pull back on the trigger makes the hammer go forward. So you are cocking, uh, you're cocking the pistol and firing the round. That is double action only. Then you have that same heavy trigger pull every time. Next is single action. Like your 1911s, if you ever had one or shot one, when you chamber around, just like that, you have the light trigger pull and the hammer is cocked back. You can engage the safety at this point if you have a 1911. This is not a 1911, so it can't do that. But if you did, you can engage the safety and you can carry your pistol that way. But with single action, the hammer is already cocked back. So with that light trigger pull, it will fire that round recoil and the hammer will come back with another light trigger pull that's single action what this pistol is is double action single action whereas the first round will be a heavy double action pull pulling the hammer back and firing the round and what that will do the round will go down the chamber exit the barrel recoil the slide comes back and forward chambering another round and now it is in single action and every shot after that till the magazine run em empty or you take the magazine out or stop firing it will be in single action mode with that light trigger pull so it will be boom heavy round fires exit the barrel hammer comes back single action trigger pull next is what is pretty popular on the market right now if you have a Glock Springfield or any kind of polymer pistol is striker fire Whereas you chamber around and you have that same trigger pull, fires, chamber another round every time. Usually a striker fire pistol is around, I would say, five to six pounds. And you get that same five to six pounds every time you pull the trigger. Whereas with a double action, it's more like 10 to 12 pounds. And single action is more like four to three pounds, really light. So that's just a quick educational video on the different kind of triggers that you're mostly going to come across. So but when you're out there buying a gun or you're talking to people about guns and you hear DAO, double action only, double action, single action, single action, striker fired, that's what they're talking about. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Give me a thumbs up if you like it. Subscribe if you haven't, uh, comment if you like it, or if you want to leave some helpful tips, please put it down in the box below. I actually like to learn from you guys, uh, get some good knowledge, so it's nice to actually learn something and actually get to help you guys learn something as well. So, as always guys, be safe, have a nice day, and shout out to Hank Strange for the patch, and shout out to 904 Outdoors. <laughs>